Basic Physics 1. If a double-acting actuating cylinder in a 3,000 pounds per square inch system has a piston with a surface area of 3 square inches on the extension side, and a rod with a cross-section area of 1 square inch attached to the piston on the other side, approximately how much force will the actuator be able to produce when retracting? 6,000 pounds of force. 2. The boiling point of a given liquid varies directly with the pressure. 3. If the fluid pressure is 800 pounds per square inch in a 1-2 inch line supplying an actuating cylinder with a piston area of 10 square inches, the force exerted on the piston will be 8,000 pounds. 4. Which atmospheric conditions will cause the true landing speed of an aircraft to be the greatest? high temperature and high humidity. 5. Which will weigh the least? 35 parts of dry air and 65 parts of water vapor. 6. Under which conditions will the rate of flow of a liquid through a metering orifice or jet be the greatest, all other factors being equal? Unmetered pressure, 17 pounds per square inch. Metered pressure, 5 pounds per square inch. Atmospheric pressure, 14.7 pounds per square inch. 7. If the volume of a confined gas is doubled without the addition of more gas, the pressure will assume the temperature remains constant, be reduced to one half its original value. 8. The temperature to which humid air must be cooled at constant pressure to become saturated is called dew point. 9. Which is the ratio of the water vapor actually present in the atmosphere to the amount that would be present if the air were saturated at the prevailing temperature and pressure? Relative humidity. 10. Which statement concerning heat and or temperature is true? Temperature is a measure of the kinetic energy of the molecules of any substance. 11. If the temperature of a confined liquid is held constant and its pressure is tripled, the volume will remain the same. 1. A wing with a very high aspect ratio in comparison with a low aspect ratio wing will have a low stall speed. 2. The purpose of stall strips on airplane wings is to ensure that the wing root areas stall first. Three. If both the volume and the absolute temperature of a confined gas are doubled, the pressure will not change. 4. What is absolute humidity? The actual amount of the water vapor in a mixture of air and water. 5. In physics, which of the following factors are necessary to determine power? 1. Force exerted. 2. Distance moved. 3. Time required. 1, 2, and 3. 6. The purpose of aircraft wing dihedral is to increase lateral stability. 7. The desired effect of using winglets on an aircraft's wing tips is to increase the lift to drag ratio. 8. Which of the following is not considered a method of heat transfer? Diffusion. 9. The speed of sound in the atmosphere is most affected by variations in which of the following? 1. Sound frequency, CPS. 2. Ambient temperature. 3. Barometric pressure. 2. 10. Which of the following is Newton's first law of motion, generally termed the law of inertia? Every body persists in its state of rest, or of motion in a straight line, unless acted upon by some outside force. 11. Aspect ratio of a wing is defined as the ratio of the wingspan to the mean cord. 12. If all, or a significant part of a stall strip is missing on an airplane wing, a likely result will be Asymmetrical lateral control at or near stall angles of attack. 13. 
An engine that weighs 350 pounds is removed from an aircraft by means of a mobile hoist. The engine is raised 3 feet above its attachment mount, and the entire assembly is then moved forward 12 feet. A constant force of 70 pounds is required to move the loaded hoist. What is the total work input required to move the hoist? 840 foot-pounds 1. An airplane wing is designed to produce lift resulting from positive air pressure below the wing's surface and negative air pressure above the wing's surface along with a downward deflection of air. 2. The speed of sound in the atmosphere changes with a change in temperature. 3. Which condition is the actual amount of water vapor in a mixture of air and water? Absolute humidity. 4. How much work input is required to lower, not drop, a 120-pound weight from the top of a 3-foot table to the floor? 360 foot-pounds.